I made mistakes, big ones. My affair has caused, I have caused, tremendous pain, and I've let a lot of people down, especially my wife Lisa and my family and my loved ones, but also Sonia Manhas and her family, my staff and colleagues and all of the employees at Multnomah County and the county residents who entrusted me with this important work. I'm deeply sorry and I hope to be able to work to reduce this pain. Two days ago, this board called for an independent investigation to determine whether my affair represented an abuse of power. I supported that call for an investigation, and I still do. I've promised to cooperate entirely with the investigation. I believe the investigation will find no abuse of power, but in any event, why call for an investigation without being willing to even let it begin? The media has been filled with accusations, innuendo, and judgments about my behavior. But we have a system based on fact-finding before condemnation. That's one of the core principles America was founded on. I deserve a chance for the facts to come out, and the community deserves it too. I understand why people are upset. I understand why my colleagues are upset. I don't understand the rush to judgment. I'm here because I care deeply about the work of the county, finding innovative, cost-effective ways to protect our most vulnerable residents and to keep our community healthy and prosperous and safe. That's why the voters elected me chair of Multnomah County. I ask my colleagues to let the investigation you've called for reach its conclusion. Then, guided by facts, by an independent finding, not a media frenzy, we can move forward. It's time to put the distraction aside and get back to work.